Hello everybody, this is Glenda with Freylands and Friends Crafts Plus. And I've got just a little bit tonight. I don't exactly know what I have. I do. <laughs> Be back in a bit. Okay, I know what I've got. I've got bangs in my face again. <laughs> I've been making some different plates. You probably noticed that the other day. I was talking to Buster and Rosie and I was ta uh, telling them I was making some some plates for them and I probably showed you these or at least you've seen them off to the side or something. But there's this one. Now, what I've got Buster's and Rosie's over here but they're drying. They, I have to paint them in stages because there's a front back and then there's the stripe I'm going to put uh, that I'm putting down the middle to write their name on. So let's see if it's dry enough. Well, it's, I only painted the stripe, so this is going to be Buster's. And I'll write his name on that yellow stripe. And you can either call Rosie's a hot Barbie pink or a very light red. No, not a very light red. A dull red. Whatever you choose. <laughs> I used this for my cutout. Or my, you know, to cut around. And then I was able to make just a little bit of a lip there. I think you can see that little bevel. By putting it in the bottom of that bowl that I'm right now baking a clam one in. So that's how I got that size. Because I wanted to try different sizes, different things. This one is from the bottom of one teacup, but it's or mug, but it's got <laughs> it's got painted water in my and paint brushes right now. But it's like this one except that it's got a rim on the bottom and so the inside of the rim was where I made the smaller one. This one I made on here. Because it's just got enough, these just have enough of a ridge that I can just get a little bit of a bevel. Which I think makes it kind of nice. Because it's just a flat one. I tried that before, didn't like it at all. So that's what I'm doing with those. And I do have, I'm making more clamshells. Well, I have just made another one. It's in there right now. And I'm probably going to need to order some more white because I think I'm going to cover that in white and what I would like to do either I might try it on one of these yellow ones first because I'd like to set it in a box. I've got a toothbrush somewhere <laughs> I've got a toothbrush what I want to do is I want to dip it in some paint and then splatter it. I want to splatter the dish to give it a different effect. Let's see what happens. <laughs> I thought that would be fun to do with a couple of them and see what happens. The clamshell when I'm baking now, I'm hoping to paint that all white and then I'd like to try and do some kind of uh, not really rainbow but a rainbow effect on it somehow. If you know what I mean. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, it's just the colors, you know, colors of the rainbow. I don't know if I will do them in stripes or in circles or just speckles. I don't know. I may check it out. I'm going to try these plates. I want you to be able to see in the box to see what I'm doing. But I don't want to splatter my camera. <laughs> recording. Okay, no, I'll just do the two. Okay, I'm going to do two little yellow ones. And I guess since I haven't had a chance to ask you, I'll have to decide to color myself. Ugh. No, that was just uncomfortable. My back hurts a little bit. Great. <laughs> 
peek at our eggs, or mine, we can either identify with it, or you can, or you will get there someday. <laughs> I could probably talk like the old wicked witch, but I can tell you who can cackle like the old wicked witch. And that's my daughter, my oldest. <laughs> we used to just use that and look. How about some yellow and green? Just for the fun of yellow and green. Okay, I'm probably going to get this. I hope the camera isn't going to get a mess. Hopefully the only thing that will get in a mess is the inside of the box. Ah. If I could ever open this toothbrush. Okay. Now. If you remember the plan, I'm taking a new toothbrush. One without all the toothpaste and stuff already been in it. Because you know that stuff's only supposed to all the way wash out. At least that's my assumption because I just don't want to have it come out otherwise. <laughs> I put some green paint on some foil over here and I've got the yellow dishes in the box as you can see. Okay. Wish me luck. This might give me <laughs> a better idea. I am getting so much on me and so little on the plates. There we go. <laughs> A very, very painty toothbrush. I've got to clean up these paint brushes later, so that's now a paint brush anyway. Well, would you like to see the result? I know I sure would. Okay. One, two, speckled greens. There we go. <laughs> I'll give you this one first. Oops, maybe not. Okay. There. Oh, I got fluff. Okay, so what do you think of that? I like this one. I think that one came out well, well covered. This one might need a little just over in this area. But I kind of like this one. Once it gets glossed, it'll be nice and shiny and all that good stuff. And I left the towels out of my reach. What? Uh, better paper towels, and if you can't reach it. Oh. I better get Rosie out of the way. Okay. There. I'm not chancing it any more than that. There. I think that corner got it now. I could have probably picked a little different color, but for this time it's yellow and green. I could add something else once all this is dry, but we're going to wait and see what what we think. I'm going to wait for your advice on what to do with I did get this done. I'm setting these out of the way where they can dry. 
I got the clamshell done. So pretty much it needs paint. And I'm not going to do that tonight because I want your ideas. I thought about doing some kind of rainbow effect. How many of the scallops have I got? One, two, three, four, five, six. Where'd I start? One, two, three. Seven, I think. I'm not real sure if I counted one any twice. I start here. One. There's a little one, but yeah. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. But some of them I don't know if I want to count. And you know my painting abilities are not high tech. <laughs> but I'm going to have you give me an idea. I figure I'll paint the whole thing white in order to, you know, kind of absorb all that. You know, with my messy fingers here. To make sure that it's, you know, coated good for absorption and stuff. And then I will take the paint brushes and do whatever I'm going to do. Or we decide for me to do. So, I'll see you tomorrow. I love you. I love you. Please do come back. <laughs> I like being silly once in a while. It's just plain fun. Please come back tomorrow. Click on the subscribe and ding on that notification. And give me a thumbs up. I got a green thumb. Finally in my life, I've got a green thumb. That's something. I know. Old kids joke. We will see you tomorrow. I love you. And good night.